National Educator. Hello, Lana. My name is Jane Sakwa. I will present a mathematics lesson from two. And the topic today is gradient of a line and equation of a line. Now, what is a gradient? A gradient is the vertical distance over the horizontal distance. It is a ratio. And this ratio measures the vertical distance and the horizontal distance. In the Cartesian plane, we can say the gradient is change in y coordinate over the corresponding change in the x coordinate. I have a diagram here. And in this diagram, I have the length here is 4 meters, the width here is 3 meters. Now we have said the gradient is a ratio of the vertical distance over the horizontal distance. Now, when we look at this diagram, the vertical distance is four meters. The horizontal distance is three meters. So we shall say that the gradient is equal to the vertical distance over the horizontal distance, which is equal to four meters over three meters. The meter and the meter will cancel out. The gradient does not have units, so we end up with the gradient being equal to 4 over 3. We can look at an example. The gradient of a line. We have said the gradient is a ratio of the vertical distance over the horizontal distance. Now here we have a question. Find the gradient of a line passing through the points 5, 7 and 9, 4. So how do you get the gradi gradient when you are given the two coordinates? Now to get the gradient, we are going to use this formula. The change in y coordinate over the corresponding change in x coordinate. Now this is how it is going to be worked out. So how do you work out this question? We want to get the gradient of a line passing through the points 5, 7 and 9, 4. Now to make it easy, write this coordinate 5, 7 and write the coordinate 9, 4 below 5, 7. Then we work out the gradient, which is change in the y coordinates over the change in the x coordinates. Now here, this is the x coordinate and these ones are the y coordinate. So to get the gradient, we've said is a change in y coordinate. So we take the y value 7 and we subtract 4. Over the change in the x coordinates, we take 5 and we subtract 9. Now 7 minus 4 will give us 3 and 5 minus 9 will give us negative 4. 3 over negative 4 can also be written as negative 3 over 4. So the gradient joining these two of the line joining these two points is negative 3 over 4. Now the gradient is also known as the, sl uh, the slope. Now next we are going to look at the equation of a line and we'll start by looking at the equation of the x-axis. Now this is the x-axis. 
this is the y axis. We want to get the equation of the x axis. Now if we pick a few points on the x axis, I pick this point. This point is negative 3, 0. I can pick another point here which is negative 2, 0.